We're out in Green Acres. So we got a good old train system, water inside the emergency. You know what that means? Unit definitely needs to get serviced, definitely needs to get maintained. This guy is a gentleman. He's going to do it right before summer, exactly how you need to do it. Right before summer, not during summer, not when it's 100 degrees out on a Sunday, 8 o'clock at night, and you got to call me, and then you got to pay three times the price for me to come out and fix it. He's going to be all set for the summer. Now with these train slinky coils, look at all that dirt flying out of it. I don't know why, but for some reason they get a lot more dirty a lot quicker. So I loaded up the Sud Blaster 2000, you know me. For some reason, I haven't been getting to any of these houses I've been servicing. I haven't gotten the best water pressure. It might be something with my hose. Soap everything out, wash it out. Oh, here we go. I know this is going to be a problem. Oh, no. So we flush out the drain, get all that gunk out, which was super clogged up. Oh, man, look at this. Now, during maintenance, I lightly clean the coils. It's not a heavy-duty cleaning. Like, this probably would have to get pulled outside and acid-treated. But the worst possible thing you can do for an air conditioner nowadays is put acid on it and let it soak with those weak coils. I just cleaned it in place. I did the best job I possibly could for them. It ain't going to be perfect, but it's going to be a heck of a lot better than what was in there to begin with. And you can see all the gunk that flew out the bottom of the pan it does look a heck of a lot better. It's going to work a lot better. Even the fan motor was all black. So I just sanitized the whole entire thing and then scrubbed it down, made sure it looked nice and pretty. Probably will smell really nice. Look at all that. That all came out of that coil. Look at those rags. Dirty. Clean out the outside electrical cabinet. Get all the dust bunnies out. The lizard was stuck, was stuck inside the capacitor. Check all the pressures. Everything looked pretty good. It's got a good little system. It was just super dirty. There we go.